What's up everybody, this is Bruce aka Geektacular and today I've got another unboxing video for you. So I'm going to be unboxing the 4K um, Ultra HD Blu-ray of Batman vs. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. This is a brand new DC animated movie. Um, they put out a lot of their own kind of self-produced, self-published um, animated movies. And um, there is a crossover comic with Batman versus the Turtles a few years ago, um, which I believe is what this is based on. There's also been a second one since then, um, but I haven't read much about this one. Uh, I think it follows the um, the original Batman versus Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles uh, crossover comic, so I think that's the story with this one. Um, I have every turtle series and movie and all that um, on on Blu-ray and DVD and whatnot. So I pretty much just pick up any uh, DVDs or Blu-rays that are Ninja Turtle related. Um, and this one just came out today, so I, I thought I would pick it up and give it a watch. So let me go ahead and just show you the slipcover here. It actually comes with this, um, it's slightly metallic slipcover. Um, it is embossed, so all this art here is embossed, as well as the logo and all that. And it is kind of shiny. Uh, it's kind of hard to see, but when you run the light over it, you can kind of see that it's it's got kind of a metallic um, undertone to it. Got Batman and the turtles there. Kind of the more um, comic book style turtles, as you can see. Um, 4K Ultra HD, Blu-ray plus digital. Here is the side of the spine. So you got the Nickelodeon and the DC uh, logo there. So it's kind of a joint um, effort there. Same thing on the side. Here is the back. The back also has the same kind of metallic sheen. Um, so when I uh, run the light over it there, you can kind of see it. It's all over. It's behind all the printed stuff on here. Nothing on this side is embossed. So this side is just kind of matte, or is there pretty much everything on the front. Uh, is embossed. So there's the back if you're curious. Special features, Cowabunga Batman when comic book worlds collide, Fight Night in Gotham, a sneak peek at the next uh, Batman animated movie. So it looks like it comes with a Movies Anywhere digital code, which is good because Ultraviolet is dying uh, slash might be dead by the time you watch this video. Um, it's slated to kind of be closed out soon. So most uh, companies are probably switching to these movies anywhere codes instead of ultraviolet. Um, and it's got a, a little window for the UPC there. So let's go ahead and pop this out. Like I usually do, we'll do a comparison of the slipcover versus the actual case. So mm, very similar cover art, pretty much identical spines, and has all the same information on both, um, just a little bit condensed on the case. So yeah, um, I still do like the, the metallic uh, finish and the embossing on, on the uh, slipcover. I think that's cool. I don't particularly like slipcovers, which you might know if you've uh, watched my channel before. So I literally have a bin just full of slipcovers. <laughs> Because <laughs> they annoy me. I I, I kind of don't like them. I don't know. I like when they're all sitting on my shelf. I kind of like the uniformity of just the standard DVD, uh, Blu-ray, and 4K Blu-ray cases. Um, but, you know, that's just me. I do appreciate it. It is kind of a nice touch, you know. Um, they don't have to include a slip cover, so when they do, I kind of feel bad about... <laughs> about disliking it or kind of being mean to them about it. Um, but, you know, it's um, I think it's a little superfluous. I don't think it's really needed. I kind of think it's just a waste of materials. Maybe just make the thing like a dollar or two cheaper and don't include a slipcover. And then, you know, everybody can be happy. This is giving me quite a hard time here. See if I can just slip this off. There we go. Okay. So let's go ahead and take a look. Um, I'll just kind of show you this one more time here. There you go. There you go once again. All right. So let's open this up. 
Okay, so the first thing that's in here is the actual um, code, which um, I will kind of obscure here, but that's what it looks like. Code, and you have a QR code that you can scan if you don't want to have to type in the code, which is pretty cool. So now here we go. Here are the disks themselves. There's nothing else in here. Um, no inner artwork or anything, just a straight uh, black Viva Elite 4K case. So here is the, the regular Blu-ray. So it's got like a silver, it's kind of got like a actually, whoa, that's really, oh no, that's, I'm seeing through the disk. I was like, I thought it, it looks like it has something like 3D under the disk, but I'm really just seeing uh, through the disk. <laughs> it's quite thin um, and you can literally see, you know, through it. But uh, yeah, so it comes in, it's kind of like this, it's, it's hard to show, but it's like a silvery blue it's kind of clear silvery blue it's disturbingly clear um i don't know that i've had many discs like this i hope this is a real disc uh it looks like i mean it looks like it but it has it it's weirdly weirdly clear some discs are a little bit clear like you can kind of see through them if you shine like bright light through them but this disc is like disturbingly clear um i kind of just want to play around with it so yeah I that's very weird very odd um, <clears throat> I'm gonna assume that it works fine I'll give it a try after this and I'll put something in the description if it doesn't but I assume that it's fine that it's just uh, manufactured like that which is really cool because this this graphic kind of goes up on top of this middle um, the middle uh, circle right here the artwork kind of like overlaps on top of that so it actually gives it kind of a cool like almost 3d ish sort of effect which is pretty neat so you got that one and here is the 4k um the 4k blu-ray which is just glossy black with the logo and all the fine print and everything kind of die cut out of it um and yeah that's pretty much it. There's no uh, inner artwork or anything like that. Uh, it's in an eco case, so yeah. Uh, but yeah, so you get the two discs, get your digital code, uh, and that's all inside of this cool kind of metallic uh, slip cover that we got here. So that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, thanks a lot for watching this unboxing. Uh, if you like this unboxing, go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. That would be awesome. Uh, if you like these kinds of unboxings, if you like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, DC Comics, if you like Funko Pops, Pez, anything like that, if you like Kaiju Films, Godzilla, if you like Star Trek, Star Wars, any of that geeky sort of stuff, go ahead and click subscribe down below and also be sure to hit that notification bell down below so that way you won't miss any of my future content. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and I'll catch you next time.